Hi friends, I'm Scott Hanselman and I want to welcome you to Visual Studio Community. It's an IDE and it runs on Windows, sure, but it actually does a lot more than you might realize. So I want to take a moment and show you some of the stuff. It's not just about Windows and C Sharp. It's in fact really, really powerful. You can make Windows applications. You can make them in C Sharp. You can make them in Visual Basic. You can make them in F Sharp. You can do pretty much anything you want in the world of Windows apps and games. And another reminder that Visual Studio is free for open source and small teams. You can check it all out at visualstudio.com. You can also do mobile development, Android, iOS, Windows. You can do both native and hybrid app development. Here I've actually got a Cordova application running. This is my Apache Cordova application that I'm working on inside of Visual Studio using JavaScript. I can run this inside of the Android emulator. This is a free Android emulator that runs on Windows and I've got full interactive debugging and all of the Apache Cordova tools that you're used to using. I can write Node applications. Node.js tools for Visual Studio extend Visual Studio and Visual Studio Community and lets you have intelligent code completion and interactive debugging, profiling tools, works with IOJS, Node.js, TypeScript, CSS, and HTML. We've also got Python. Python and Visual Studio, it's just an add-on. It lets you have both C Python, PyPy, Iron Python, and more. In fact, right here is a Django web project. I'm actually in the middle of running this Django application. IntelliSense, syntax highlighting, debugging, all on Windows in the same IDE. Once you learn Visual Studio, you know Visual Studio. You're going to feel comfortable no matter what language you're deciding to use. Maybe you're going to create a game. Maybe you're going to use Unity and it's going to integrate with Visual Studio. You can write DirectX games. You can use them with the top game engines that are available. Right here, I've already got Unity running. We'll hit play here and take off in my airplane inside of Unity. We're doing an interactive debugging session with Visual Studio. Take off. Here I've hit a break point. Step through, change my game, keep flying. All in the same IDE that I'm used to using for all my development. You can also build stuff for the cloud. You can build stuff for IoT, whether it be tiny devices in 64K or giant systems in the web in 64 gigs and 64 terabytes of storage. You can host 10 web apps for free. And when you host those web apps and you make those applications, you can use source control like GitHub or Visual Studio Online. Here in the Team Explorer in Visual Studio, I can use Visual Studio Online and Git to keep my source code safe or I can collaborate with others using GitHub in the GitHub for Windows. Whatever language makes me happy, I can do it in Visual Studio. C, C++, C Sharp, VB, F Sharp, Node, Python, games, mobile, cloud, IoT, it's all there. And the best part is that Visual Studio Community is not only free, it's also extensible. We've got over 5,000 different extensions and products that plug into Visual Studio from IDE extensions that allow you to do Arduino development inside of Visual Studio Online to things like Web Essentials that make the CSS and HTML editor even greater. All of this is in Visual Studio. It's all free and it's available to you. Check out Visual Studio Community. I hope you're as excited about this as I am and I welcome you to our community. Thanks.